Okay, we got a little cool down there. Going fakey switch seems pretty natural, but I don't want to chance it and really mess up. I'll get used to doing it <clears throat> like the way it feels comfortable first. So today what I'm working on, um, very self-critical person, but uh, let's just say I know how to jump like okay. So I'm not really worried about jumping right now. Although it will help me 180 better. I'm working on rollouts, manuals, and potentially some 180s here. <clears throat> Maybe this is terrible footage that nobody would like to see but you know what I'm a guy out here that does not have the manuals locked in and I really want them locked in so bringing you with on my struggle to get them maybe I never do it maybe that's part of life too some things people, some people just are not good at. And you gotta be like, oh, well, that's one of them, you know. But I feel confident enough to proceed. I've had a couple of pretty good manuals in my life but even the last couple days I had a couple decent ones these are all looking pretty shitty That's a good start. And I'm like 60 40 on the rollouts. I can get them like 40, maybe even 45% of the time. But that's not a shotgun loaded trick either, where it's just loaded in there and I can just whoop it out. Just like anything else, see there's two in a row I didn't even get. Like anything else, the more reps you do, the more better you'll be at it. And I'm just finding my comfortable positions and <clears throat> body position is everything. Bike control is everything. The height of your jump is nothing you know and stuff like that like you need to control your bike before you can soar they say slow manuals are the really hard ones they say a lot of things for some reason i like manualing up an incline better because it feels like i can go farther before i loop out Now it's on, <clears throat> but I've been mostly working the slow manuals because I'm a little leery 
of being able to get rid of that much speed if I got to come off of it. So I'll be a man about it, you know. Be a man. Yeah! Had some lean to her, but... And the reason why I'm pairing the manuals with the fakie sliders is because they both require a lot of weight to the back end of the bike. So, in my opinion, they go hand in hand. But, <clears throat> should not be afraid about coming off the bike because you have to know how to bail. I'm just a little leery of coming off the bike at a high rate of speed. I'm gonna save the, <coughs> the 180s so I get tired of doing this. I love it back here. This is like the new spot. I hope. I really hope nobody minds. I ain't bugging. No more. Ooh, almost went in for a double tap. You gotta be okay with failing a lot. That's what it takes. <laughs> I keep wanting to go. Uh, oppo rollout. And it does not feel under control, even though I don't have it every time the other way. But. I need to gain control of the bike. And that's why